and welcome to our show. It's not necessarily in the kitchen yet. No, it's not. But you know what? We haven't been out and about lately, and something that has changed on the farm, as, as it happens, we kind of show people. Right. We put a new fence up. I love it. You love it? Yes. The movable fence is great. It's wonderful. But you know what? We really put up a lot of fence here. It goes way down in the back. I like that. So as the sheep pick this side, mm -hmm. they can go way down there and eat. And when that's done, this will grow back up and they can eat Move over here and kind of rotate like back that. and forth. And we're happy that we're not... Moving fence anymore. Yeah. Right. That's kind of a task. Oh yeah, it is a lot of work. So we showed last week, Scott was out here and he showed how to brace a post. Right. He does a great job. He does. He also showed us how to put up a gate. Mm -hmm. And we're just going to show kind of fast motion. Basically what he did is drilled some holes and he put all the hanging mechanism on there. Hung the fence, leveled it. Then came back, made sure it swung all right, made sure we had clearance on the bottom. Right. And then he put a little, another little jag on the bottom so he can just lift it up like and that. set it there. That's and that nice. way it won't continue to fall. Right. So we have this wonderful fence. We're gonna love this so much this Oh morning. yeah, it looks pretty too, I like it. And have you noticed one more thing that we have here that wasn't here last week? What, a couple hmm. kids? <laughs> a couple kids, the grandkids are here from Michigan. Hey, what are you doing? He's got a kid there. <laughs> and we've had fun with the animals, we've had we fun have. in the pool. We have. We've had fun just kind of hanging around, eating, mm -hmm. eating stuff that yeah. we don't normally eat, right. Grandma. Eating bad is fun. Excuse you, Moses. <laughs> <laughs> what is up with that? I think he had some Doritos. Yes, he did. He's got his bone right here. He's <laughs> yeah, holding taco. his bone. So right. anyway, anytime we have visitors, we always invite them to cook. Right. So I think Taryn might have a recipe yeah. for us. Some what, what, what is your recipe? So it's like a Parmesan mac and cheese. Oh. And you. <laughs> <laughs> Moses, you're just kind of, you're kind of. Ew, awkward. it's good you get your boots on. shedding and he's sneezing today. He's and got he's, the allergies. Yeah, he's kind of. He got kinda, it on your boot. You're good. We're good. Okay, back to the macaroni and cheese. So it's like a Parmesan mac and cheese and you can get like a mozzarella and then so if some people kind of like it stringy. Stringy? Bugs. <laughs> yeah. Some people like it stringy. It's good to add some. So walk us through it. So basically you're going to take like heavy cream and butter. So you get um you boil noodles and cook them. Gotcha. And then you put like butter and heavy cream in it. And then after that, you add Parmesan. All right. And then if you like it stringy, you can add some mozzarella. Yeah. So you're, this is a, this is a, like a white mac and cheese. Yeah. I'm digging it. I'm hungry. I'm absolutely digging it. That sounds good. So we'll do that tonight, and we'll just have that. You know, you can make a meal on that. Oh yeah. There's no carbs delicious. in macaroni. No, macaroni is good for you. <laughs> so let's do that here in a little while. Let's let's play a little more with the animals. Okay. There's Maggie and Millie sitting back there. Now there's a reason that we have Moses here and the girls over here. And I've tried to explain it in very general terms, or she got it. Yeah. Yes. I didn't have to go into great detail. Yeah. Now the sheep are in the back. They've got so much stuff they can eat back there. It's going to be a couple weeks, Nick, before we got to oh, yeah, just them. open the gate. Yeah. Now Scott hasn't put that gate on yet. We're firming up over there. Got some concrete. And guess what? We're, We're good. done. Yay, we can have babies again. Baby sheep. Yee dogs. Yay. All right. You know what, Grandma? What? 
pressure's off of us tonight. That's right. Because I'm going to make my fried fish, and we know that's good. Yes. Last time you did a recipe, it was good, but it was kind of, you know, you were, you were much younger then, and it was just kind of easy ice cream stuff. You actually moved up to the burner here. That's pretty impressive. I know. So let's let's go back. We talked in the field before we chased the animals. Was that fun chasing the animals, Sam? Yeah. Was that a lot of fun? Yeah. They liked him. You were quite the shepherd. <laughs> <laughs> so here's what we're gonna do. Go ahead and walk us through this again. Now, now you make this. You've made this before, right? Yeah. Can you guarantee us it's gonna be good? Yes. Thousand percent. Yeah. Yes. Is it? Do you like it too? Yeah. You like our micro? Okay. Yeah. We made Pressure's a very up, Grandma. Small bash, Maybe bash we should. Before and I it was terrible like, because I like it too. we all wanted more so much. More. Oh, everybody wanted more. more. Yeah. Oh, I'm excited oh, to have got it. Enough. I'm gonna fry fish. We're gonna have some fresh organic corn on the cob. Oh, yum. Um, yes. Kelly brought some kind of biscuit mix. We're gonna do. And we have sweet potatoes. Oh my goodness. We're gonna have a good dinner. So what we have done is we've got you a pan. We've got your serving dish to put it in once we're there. Tell us what we're gonna do. We're, we've now we've already got the. You like bow ties, right? Yeah. We got your bow ties going. Um, I usually add the milk first, then I'll add the noodles right after that, just so they're not sitting hot on the bottom of the pan. I like it. So we got three quarters of a cup. Now this is heavy whipping cream. You can't hardly go wrong with that. I now think what? We should turn the burner on. Turn the burner on. Obviously, we're going to turn that on low. We don't want to. Yeah, really low. Well. We don't want to scorch it. Then I'd probably add the noodles. The noodles? Yeah. All right. I just put the milk in first, so they won't like burn to the bottom. All right. I like the sound of that. I'm just gonna try to not splash everybody here. You did good, Papa. <laughs> All right, then. I'm gonna break them up a little bit. Yeah. Oh. Wow, that's gonna be oh, yum. Separated. It's gonna be so yum. This is gonna go good with our fried fish and corn on the cob and yeah. sliced tomatoes, fresh sliced tomatoes. Yeah. Are you kidding me? Oh, yeah. Control here, fresh cotton fish. <laughs> That's gonna be that young. After that, I usually add the butter to it. Then the butter? Yeah. Let that slowly melt in there, I would imagine. Yeah. How much butter, Grandma? That looks like about. Can we do a half about two of them? Two of them? Yeah, just add two. They're like in two tablespoon thingies, so that's two tablespoons. That's another two tablespoons. You sure you don't want it all? Oh no. Let's have it all. It's yeah. right out of my hand. Butter's delicious. I hate it when that happens. Butter's delicious. All right. Delicious. So we're gonna let that melt. All right, looks like your butter is being eaten melt. You want to go ahead and no. do this? You want to do it? Yeah. Sure. That was about half a cup. We got a Parmesan half a cup cheese. Half Parmesan, yep. okay. No. How much noodles was there, Maggie? We did a whole box of bow ties. A whole box yep. of bow ties. Ooh, that smells good. How about I'm going to think you might cheese. be onto something here, Taryn. Taryn, say, add cheese. I just thought of it one night before dinner, and then I was like, let's just make this. Do the cheese add. Yum. I'm digging it so far. I like it, too. And that's not even all no, her ingredients. I'm gonna turn it down just a little bit. A little salt and pepper? Yeah. No, I don't like salt and pepper. Salt and pepper makes it good. Not too much pepper though. That's Teletary pepper, that's good. That's special. Yeah, it's a good pepper. That's from stuff. the Teletary Mountains. Where, yes. Where I do like Glenn that. Glenn just, they found him at the top of the mountain. Really? Of uh, the Teletary Pepper Mountain. Yeah. And he forgot to bring water and he was dehydrated. Mm. So he had to what slide all the way down to the bottom. Oh, yeah. Really? And then there was the, there was the Pepper police. Uh oh, he's in trouble again. Right he gets in. in trouble every time. You know what? I'm gonna turn it down a little bit more because it's starting to get pretty hot. Now, when do we add this cheese? Oh, uh, we gotta make sure that this isn't chunky because if you add that, then it might get chunky earth. Because... Hmm. Interesting. I don't see much chunkies. I think it looks perfect. I'm ready. Can now we this? Yeah. Yeah. Just a little bit of time. And that was about three quarter of a cup we measured there. That's mozzarella. All mozzarella yeah. cheese. Right. She wants yeah. it white. No, you can no. add like um, there's a shredded parmesan, but I think mozzarella is better to add just mm. different cheeses. I'm gonna turn it down. And it gets a little bit stringy too. When you I do like it. stringy mozzarella. Yeah. Hmm. I think she's on something, girl. Oh, this looks really good. I think All it's right, ready. Watch. What do you think? That's not fair. I think it's just another All right. minute of getting. Just more. another minute. All right, yeah. I'm gonna get a fork. Me and Grandma are gonna sample and give you our. Estimations. Oh wow, Taryn, yum. Yum. Grandma, let's see what we got here. Man, look at that. I try. Mmm. Oh Can yes. Do you want to try one? Yes. Do you like to try one too? Blow on it. Did you get it? Are you kidding me? Wow. We got talent in the family. Oh, that is so good, Taryn. Good job. Taryn, I gotta give you, and I'm being dead serious. 
I've had a lot of macaroni and cheese. That's as good as anybody, That's, as I've eaten anywhere. And you made that up yourself. What? Really? That is so good. In a minute, we'll get you a bowl. You know what, Taryn? It's absolutely delicious. We're gonna put that in the oven, just to keep it warm. And then we're gonna get our fish I done like and our corn done. What? You don't like When you put it in the oven, it makes magic flowers come out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna put this in the oven. Let it stay warm, because that's too good to waste. We yeah, don't want any delicious. of that to go away. We come back in a minute after we get our fish out. I'm telling you what. I'm excited. Fantastic, kiddo. Good job. That really is good. It is really good. That's better than the store-bought. It is. Can I try? All right, let's put it in the oven. 